Our memo not to be Uthman Mensah. Let's now settle for the details. Minority in Parliament has reiterated its calls to the, on government to expedite work on the reconstruction of the La General Hospital. During a visit to the site, the ranking member of the Health Committee of Parliament, Kwabna Minta Akando, assured of the minority's resolve to push for the health center to be completed. The health facility was demolished in March 2020 for redevelopment due to the dilapidated nature of the structures. Two years on, work is yet to commence on the site despite several assurances from the government. The project is being financed by a credit facility from Standard Chartered Bank of the United Kingdom with an export credit guarantee from Sinoshio of the People's Republic of China to the tune of £68 million with an insurance cover of £3,860 million. The project will be undertaken by a Chinese company, Poly Changda. Upon completion, it will be transformed into a 160-bed facility and will be fitted with an outpatient department, inpatient wards, maternity and neonatal services, surgical unit with four theaters, accident and emergency department, public health department, pharmacy unit, laboratory, administration, imaging area with CT scan, X-ray room, ultrasound, fluoroscopy, mammography units, physiotherapy unit and a mortuary. The facility, which was formerly known as the La Polyclinic, was established in the early 1960s. It mainly serves residents of La Osu, Teshi, Nungwa and its surrounding areas with their health care needs.